Hello, everybody. Hi there. We are at Pizza Land today. We're at pizza Land. For the Oneonta Pizza Tournament of Pizza Glory. Pizza Glory. We got we, uh, pizza. We have an exciting announcement before we get started. We do have an exciting um, announcement. We have our podcast now. New podcast. New podcast. Nate and Robert STS, baby. Where we shoot the shit. We so, shoot to find this shit. podcast, you have two options. You can look up Nate and Robert STS on Apple Podcasts or Spotify, um, or you can click the links down in the description, um, and you can go there. F feel free to support us uh, if you feel led. That would help us a lot. Um, give us a follow. But for now, let's go eat some pizza. Rate us. Listen to the first podcast. Rate us five stars. Five stars. You have to listen to the podcast, but listen to it. Give us five stars because we deserve it. We do. We talk about we talk about how to start a podcast. Yep. We talk about Speechify. Yep. Which is an app that you probably don't know what that is. Yep. And we talk about is Morbius good? Yeah. And I'm sure all Robert things, will tell you all about things that. Things we don't know about, you know. Well, so it makes it more fun. We know now about Morbius. We do know now about Morbius. More to come on that tonight. Yeah. So look forward to that. But for now, we're gonna go in and we're gonna get some fucking, some fucking pizza. pizza. Hey, let's do Gabagool. it. Gabagool. Bada bing, bada bing. Alright. We are back with pizza. From Pizza Land today. Pizza Land. Um, I'm excited. I'm ex it looks, it, it smells, smells really great. good. It really does. Are you starting things. your car? Oh, oh no, 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 no. Okay. So, ready for the reveal? Oh, that looks so good. Oh, it looks really, looks really fucking good. good. Oh. It looks really fucking good. Oh, it really man. Great presentation. Man, that looks good. Oh, my God. The cross on the bottom is... <laughs> oh, <laughs> shit. Dude. Look at this. That is a perfect fucking vlog, Mine's dude. cut a little bit, but I, that's understandable. Oh, man. This one oh, folded. Man. It doesn't cut. Oh, that's the best slice of pizza yet. So <laughs> good. That is the best slice of pizza yet. I'm gonna cry. Damn. The ratio of sauce to cheese is so good. This is perfect. It's I don't even know. <laughs> 100 out of 100. This is so no, good. No, but like, this is the best slice of pizza we've had. No, there's no question to that. No. I love Molly's. Mm -hmm. This is so much better. Let's get into the specifics. For Heat. Sure. Really good. Really it's good. It's I, I took a bite right as I opened the box. Yeah, it's hot, but it's not like mm -hmm. I can't eat it. Mm. The crust is just incredible. I haven't tasted mm. the crust yet. Mm, a little bit of drippage, but I've forgiven. I don't love the texture of the crust. Really? Of the, like the actual crust. Oh, yeah. It's a little chewy. Yep. A little chewy. But, but the bottom is the surface is incredible. This is it's impeccable. fucking fantastic. It's absolutely impeccable. Ah, uh, cheese mm, bowl, mm. excellent, perfect. Mm -hmm. Okay, let <clears throat> me try a little bit of this. It sauce. is a bit greasy, though. I will say that it doesn't look greasy, but it is greasy. That was just all grease. There was no sauce. Let me try to <laughs> examine it, Jay. The sauce isn't super sweet. No, it's a think a good blend. Yeah. Of sweet and salty and tangy, and I think that's the best cheese taste we've had. Oh, a hundred percent! It's really good cheese taste. My drippage has kind of stopped though. Mine is not. Mine is very greasy. It just keeps going. Mmm. Wow. Pizza land out of fucking nowhere. Literally, I don't know if this existed. Out of nowhere. Oh. This is no competition. It's so good. <laughs> wow. Wow. The um the sauce is good, the cheese is good, crust texture is a little bit off, crust taste. A little bland. Mm -hmm. I think a lot of the flavor is good from coming from the sauce and the cheese. Mm -hmm. I think the like, is fine. It's not it's not super, but it's fine. But the texture in the actual mm -hmm. 
sauce cheese and part of the pizza. The slice is so good. It's fucking perfect. It's 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 crunchy. It's crispy. It's it's yeah, awesome. Yeah, I mean, I'm gonna rain down a little. I can't think of um something really bad to say about it. <laughs> I can't. Ugh. The presentation, it's a little white mm -hmm. on here. Mm -hmm. Not a lot of golden happening. I bet that's getting like really specific. But I'll take it into account. We've got some nice bubbles. Mm -hmm. A little bit of grease pulling right there. Mm -hmm. Certainly. I think grease is, is one of the lower categories on this list. Oh, um, yeah, for sure. I mean, we have to judge it. We have to judge each category independently of mm -hmm. the others. So, for sure. It's definitely going to lose a few points on greasiness because it is fairly greasy. Well, I'm going to get started on my next slice here. Because mm -hmm. I think I need more to know. What oh, is yeah. It? What is it? Is it? It's not cornmeal on the bottom. Maybe it is. Might just be excess flour. Yeah, maybe they use flour and not cornmeal. Okay. Okay. Well, hold on. <laughs> Getting more sauce. The sauce is a little sweet. I like the sauce a lot. It's good. Let me grab some. Uh huh. It is really sweet. I know it's right now. Hmm. The new slices have way more like sauce. Yeah. Yeah. But the crust, so many other things about this pizza are just fantastic. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. So many other things. Oh, my goodness. I mean, I can't think of much bad to say. No, I mean, ugh. It's just a solid slice of pizza. Yeah. And it's like the perfect amount of doughy. Mm hmm On the actual, like, inside of the slice. I don't know if it can focus on things that close. On the actual, like, inside of the slice, it's like the perfect amount of doughy. I'm like, fucking whatever. For sure. It's going to be high. Yeah, almost certainly. I'm wondering if it'll be higher than Molly's. Wow. I can't think of much bad to say here. This is way better than I thought it was going to be. Mm-hmm. Getting to the end of this piece, the crush is a little more chewy. Yeah, for sure. And I think that the bottom is a little bit less crispy as well. Mm-hmm. Because I think this is the ones that are like a fresh pie. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And even with the advantage that we gave to um, Dante's, it was not to this level of freshness. No. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. No pizza has tasted this fresh. No. Except maybe Molly's. Well, Molly's is up there. Yeah, Molly's is good. Yeah. You know... The more and more that it tastes the sauce, the, the least I like it. But it works it really works well. It works with the cheese a mm -hmm. lot. All right. mm -hmm. That last slice is not mine. I'll put this away. I think we're ready to hit the scoreboards and come back to you guys with our ratings. See you soon. We will now grade Pizza Land Pizza. Here we go. I just dropped my fucking phone under your seat. Hold on. All right. Nice. This is elite pizza. This is elite. This is, for our area, elite. Robert, you go first. Heat. 10. 
10. Absolutely. No questions asked. Perfect. I've given, I do have to rectify. I cannot change my score. I would change Pizza 23 West's 10 on heat to a 9. Thinking back to how perfect these last two heats have been. In yeah, my I, gave, opinion, I gave it a 9. Uh, I, I would have to go back and rectify that. But for presentation, presentation, I gave it an 8. I gave it a 10. You gave it a 10 I for fucking, presentation. Dude, that pizza looked so good. It looked really fucking good. Really I docked good. a point for grease pool, and I docked I a point for a little bit of whiteness on the crust. That's that didn't fair. make it look super golden. I agree. I did, I did think the white crust was a little a little weird. Uh, I didn't see any grease on mine, so I didn't um, I didn't enough. do that. The grease was awful, but it wasn't. It didn't look awful. Yeah. So I didn't put that down. What did you give it for greasiness? Four. You went much lower than I did. I really contemplated going with a six on mm -hmm, this one, mm -hmm. but I went with a seven. A seven. Because the grease, my lips are a little greasy. My mm -hmm. mouth feels fine. There wasn't too much mouth taste in my opinion. Yeah, it wasn't a mouth problem, more so it was a mess problem for me. I did not get that much of a drippage. That's so great. mine was dripping I had to go with a seven on my That's greasiness. Great. Cheese pull. Nine. Nine. Yep. Absolutely. I also gave it a nine. Yeah. <laughs> it was just, uh, it could have pulled a little bit more. Yeah. But it didn't do it. It was just fucking it amazing. So the way the cheese it, worked. It, it yeah. stretched, but it didn't like, it didn't like dribble down your face. You yeah. Pull it off. Exactly. It was really well done. So flop factor, I gave it a ten. Nine. I gave it a ten because when I held it in that fucking New York fold, it went like this. It went like that at the yep. end, and that's what I wanted. That's perfect. My problem is when I folded it, the crust was so um, crusty, crusty, that it like crispy snapped a little word. bit. Crispy is the word, the word. And it kind of snapped the pizza in half a little bit, and that made it more difficult to eat with the grease. Um, so I took a point off from flop. Okay, for okay, all right. Crust text? Seven. Four. You went really low on crust I, texture. Uh, my last slice that I had, I didn't even finish the crust. Because the, the crust was just so doughy at the end. Yeah, it got I, a little is, doughy. The, the points... I think, your, I I think yours it, was a little doughier than mine. Yes, I agree. And I think that my points that I gave it are mainly for the crust texture under the slice, which was perfect. Mm -hmm. um, but I, I, it definitely lacked a lot from the actual crust, which yeah. the crust for me is, is probably my favorite part of the pizza. It's it's a hot topic. But like I, I really like to eat the crust. I'm a I, crust guy. I also like eating the crust. The problem was, though, I think yours was doughier than mine. Yeah, that's true. The one I had got doughy, but I finished it, and it was freaking amazing. That's awesome. Um, crust taste. Five. I give it an eight. An eight? It was... Uh, Bland, bro. <sighs> I don't know what happened to me, man. It just... I got through the first slice that was a little bland. Mm -hmm. And I got to the second slice... And I think that while it was sitting, some of the ta taste from other parts of the pizza maybe soaked into the crust. I don't know. Awesome. That, second second slice, worse. that second slice drove me over the edge to making this a really good pizza. I don't know. My second slice was worse in terms of crust taste. I think we had different experiences with our I think it's possible. Our, our it's slices. certainly possible. That's why we do two. That's why we do two. And not just one. That's right. All right. Sauce. Five. Seven. Seven. It was a little too, a little too sweet. Yeah. When I got a bunch of it, it was a little too sweet. I think that my grading, I have to, I have to admit, my grading, I was riding on the high of that initial yeah, impression. For sure. And I think that the first impression of pizza can be the most important. I agree, and I think that the soft taste is really sweet, and I like it when it works with the cheese. It just doesn't work alone. Like it is a very sweet yeah. sauce by itself. Like I wouldn't want to use it for dipping. Cheese. Cheese taste seven. Seven. I went with a nine. Wow. I went really high for this pizza. Really I have good. no affiliation with Pizza Land whatsoever. No, we have. We've never been here. Like we literally have never been here. Something about the way that the sauce and the cheese work together. I agree. That's why drove I my score taste. up, yeah. and that is what made me give them such high scores a seven yeah. and a nine. Yeah. They just like the, them working together drove it up. Yeah, well, and that's why for overall taste, I gave it a 9. I also gave it a 9 yeah, for overall taste. I think that taste. overall they yeah. work really well, but separately not so much for me. That's a, that's very fair. Yeah. What is your total score? 72. I have an 84. This might be our biggest disparity yet. Oh my gosh, that's crazy. Yeah. So that puts us at a... Someone do the math. I'm getting it. I'm getting it. 72 plus 84 divided by 2. 78. 78. It has topped... Molly's. 
Yeah, it uh, Molly Knocking Panera 22. out of the list. Well, Panera is still top three. No, it's not. Pizza 23 is. Yep. Panera is not top three. Panera is no longer uh, has a shot unless it has a golden yeah. buzzer yeah. for the yeah. best pizzeria in Oneonta. Wow. Wait, what happened to all my notes? Wait. Right oh, it's right here, duh. <laughs> all right, so that would mean, what was it, a 74? 78. 78. 78 for Pizza Land. Our top three, Pizza Land with a 78, Molly's with a 70.5, wow. and Pizza 23 West with their yellow ass crust <laughs> yeah. with a 66. It's so good. Oh my gosh. By, by 7.5 points, it knocked, it oh, knocked wow. everything down a yeah. good notch. I, that's got a good chance of being in the top three. I mean, that's, I think it's going to be. I yeah. think, I now think Pizza Land has earned its spot it has absolutely it has i i did not think it's gonna be good and it was really no. fucking good it, it, i think the initial shock value and yes. the first impression we got with opening the box oh, oh yeah taking oh, that yeah. bite being so impressed absolutely just made me go i uh, pizzas don't do that no they don't do that like that that pizza when i opened it, i was like i was i was like a little Floored. kid in like a fucking candy amusement shop. park amusement park amusement park yeah floored the pizza floored me on that note, check out the Nate and Robert STS. Yes, join more, us. We might next talk week. more about this pizza. Yep. We might, we will probably talk about more beefs after we you put out your review will, today yeah. or tomorrow. It'll be up today. It'll be up today. So, uh, yeah, I mean. Next week we're going to Nick's, and I've never been there either for their pizza, so. It's interesting. You've we'll had see. Their pizza? I've had the pizza before. Yeah. Interesting. All right, this yeah. is exciting. And then that's it for Westside. And then that's it for Westside. And we're on to random places? Yeah, we have two random places. Pizza two miscellaneouses. Yep. Yep. All right. Well, we'll see you next week then. Uh, subscribe if you're not already, because um, if you're not, you're just being mean. So That's rude. That's rude, man. We're here bringing you fucking content. Subscribe. You got to know what's the best pizza. That's exactly. why we're here. We're doing it so you don't have to. Exactly. We eat the pizza. Because expensive. <laughs> yeah, I've probably spent close oh, yeah. to $50 on pizza. 50? Uh, I would say probably $70. We've gone to like six places, though. Yeah, and each one of And you didn't pay for one. That's true, I didn't. <laughs> That's true, I didn't. All right, well, thank you guys for so much for watching. Robert, you take care of the outro. Bye. Oh.